And I get around Hawkball, Harpon. This is Barry in the in the PI. Okay. Give it to you. I'm I'm gonna try to imitate Barry's intro. And Barry's intro goes something like this. Hello! This is this is James and you're watching my PI Dream and Barry in the PI. <laughs> Got it? Okay. Uh. Anyway, you probably know that was a little bit different of an intro that we were doing here today on My Pi, PI Dream. But today is a very special episode. Today is an episode we traveled all the way to this is Alfonso, Alfonso Cavite, right? right this is yeah. Alfonso Cavite. And we're celebrating Barry's birthday. This is Barry's, Barry's 80th, 80th, 80th birthday. birthday. So come on and join us today for a wonderful episode on our trip here, close to Tagaytay and Alfonso Cavite. Hey, hey Barry, I got a question for you. What? what what's it like being 80 years old? Uh, well, I, I was young yesterday, and now I'm real old no. man. <laughs> well, I got, I got another question for you. Are you going to join me for my 80th birthday at my house in Lipa? Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll be there. Okay. So anyway, Barry, Barry, do me a favor. Do me a favor, and I want you to show the, uh, the folks a little bit of your yard. I always go to your channel. They haven't come to your channel yet. So uh, I know... The uh, these are the lobster claws you I always see on your channel right here. That's the yeah. the little reddish color flowers that you have inside yeah. there. Uh, yeah, these are lobster claws. We got these down by the, the creek, down by the bridge. There are a whole bunch of them just growing in that jungle there. Yeah, yeah. And so I had uh, one of the guys dig up a couple of them, and bring them, plant them up here. And they keep growing, they expand. Yeah, they, grow. yeah, they are. The the multiple flying over there. Now, I always hear, I always hear about the angel trumpets. Let's go, let's go, let's go take a look at your angel right. trumpets. I know, I know way much more than I need to know about angel trumpets these days yeah. because of your channel. Now, yeah. what is this one? This is angel's trumpet. Oh, this one is? Yes. Oh. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, they don't have the angel, the, the little trumpets on the flowers on there anymore. Not right now. Oh, from the typhoon we there just there had. Yeah. That may be opening up. Yeah. Uh, oh, there you go. Here we got some over here. Yeah, there's some here. Yeah. Yeah. So, the history, the history of the. Uh, it was uh, found in in the Ecuadorian and, and Peruvian parts of the Amazon and uh, the native people there warned people about taking them because if they misuse the try to get high on them they can kill them you know or, or make them go on a 15 hour high <laughs> trip they were worried about these getting out and people misusing these uh, but people wanted them because of the big beautiful flowers they put out. When we moved into this house, our yard man, uh, he would, he went, went through the jungles here and, and pulled up some. From right here, in the yeah. local neighborhood, yeah. like around here, yeah. And uh, he planted them, he planted them over there, but I wanted to move them over here where they, people can see them. Yeah, yeah. They've also been studied as a, uh, uh, treatment for cancer, and they found to be effective against certain types of cancer. So, for you're, you're talking about the uh, the angel, tr yeah. the angel trumpets. Now, is it the flower or the, the plant leaf, leaf, the leaf. leaf on? I think the there's leaf. a lot of there's a lot of uh, plants and vegetation in the Philippines mm -hmm. that are used for medicinal purposes. Yeah, yeah. I, I see that all the time. Yeah, you boil you boil the leaves and. I guess you drink it. Yeah. Is that what you? I guess yeah, that's well, what I don't know. <laughs> that's how people get high. <laughs> so one of our workers here, when they were planted, said, "Barry, you don't need your bourbon. 
boil some of this and take it. <laughs> Speaking of vermin, I think, what did you say on one of your videos? You said if James comes, you have a, is it what, a 12, 12? I have a 12 year old. 12 year old uh, vermin. vermin yeah. Okay, well, I'm looking forward to so, that. So, okay, we're gonna get it out a little bit. <laughs> this is, this is yeah. beautiful. You have a lot of the same, uh, the bedding type of plants here. Mm -hmm. A lot of them are very, very similar to the ones that we have. We have yeah. these around, uh, around Nessa's, she has a Zen garden in the front of the yard. Yeah. And these these are really beautiful. This is this is nice. This is the nice way you decorated it with the the lawn garden yeah. furniture out here. Yeah. Really nice. We had to get these repainted just the other day, the last week. Now does does this light up at nighttime over here? Uh, you can. Yeah. The lanterns. Yeah. The lanterns. Yeah. Is it electric or is it uh, or is it real candles? It looks like real candles in there. Now this has oh, got yeah. some nice. This has yeah. got some nice yeah. flowers on it right I here. It's a false bird of paradise, is what it's called. And, and this, this is, is crazy. Golden, Look uh, at this shrimp plant. Ah, golden shrimp plant. Yeah. And uh, this is. I guess this is. This is the beginning, and then yeah. it, it will do these little yeah. white. <laughs> That's so neat. Now this is. I know this is a coconut tree right yeah. here. Is that a, a dwarf or is that a, a no, regular size it's, it's one? It's just a regular size. You know, they get, yeah, grow. that's all they get. They get yeah. like 50 feet tall. And then here is a coffee tree. Oh, yeah. And here's the coffee yeah, beans. Some of the coffee beans right oh, here. There. Yeah. About ready to for me to pick. Yeah. Now, now Barry, have you have you done any have you done any uh, Processing of the coffee beans, done any of the roasting? No, I haven't. I, 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 it's, I it's really hard. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I was going to go to the coffee producers uh, department at the, the uh, Department of Agriculture. I think it's just as easy to go to grocery store and get a bag yeah. of coffee beans. Huh? Yeah. But, uh, for this yeah, that's, uh, and this, I know this is, this is your silage. Uh, yeah. Pepper plants yeah. right here. We have lots of those all over our yard. Right. Yeah. They grow anywhere, right? They just pop up. Yeah. Yeah. They just. Yeah. And here's another coffee. Another co tree. another coffee tree. Oh, oh, look. Yeah, this one's got a lot of beans on it. Look at that. Yeah. yeah. Now, I know somewhere in your yard, you have a cacao. Yeah. We're, we're, we're hidden back. I want to see the cacao. Oh, this uh, is pepper. Peppercorn. This is yeah. This is peppercorn. You know we have peppercorn too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. One plant. We have one plant. Yeah. It, it, We've got a bunch. Grows, of grows like crazy. Have you ever, when they got black, have you crushed yeah. them up and used yeah. them for cooking? Yeah, yeah. We've got. That's what we use in. This is a really years. healthy. Wow. This is a really healthy peppercorn plant that you got right here. Yeah. I think I'm gonna have to take ours and put it out in the sun, the bright sunlight. It's back in our by raised bed garden, and we have so much vegetation. We have too much shade in the backyard now, yeah. so. It, I think it's prohibiting. And, uh, here is a big coffee tree. Okay, but yeah. you got lots of blossoms, so yeah. you're going to be getting a lot I'm ready more. For, I've been waiting for them to turn yeah. red, you know. But uh, well, I, I certainly hope you do a video. Look at all of them on yeah, here. I, I certainly hope you do a video on how you take them and then you process them, you roast them, yeah. and, and actually gonna, make. I, I, I want to see that. that. I want to see that. Watch your step. And, uh, step and then more, more peppercorn. Yeah. Wow, calamansi tree, right? Calamansi, yep. yeah. Might it keeps the uh, harvests those all the time. Yeah, he uses them in. Oh, we oh we we have two calamansi and two babies right now, uh, two small seedlings, and yeah. uh, I can't get enough. To, I, I don't think four calamansi trees are are enough for us at our house as much as we drink calamansi yeah. juice. Now and that's a cacao tree. There's the cacao. I remember. And there's. I want you to look at the size of the leaves on, on this right here. These are yeah, huge they leaves. They look a little like the coffee leaves, but these are a little bigger. Now, how old is this this uh, cacao tree here? I I'm not sure. I'm gonna I, I'm I gonna say about five years, at least. Yeah, at least yeah. five years. Yeah. Yeah. And this is what the cacao looks like. And it's it's and for those of you who don't know what cacao is, it's actually coca. Uh, chocolate. Do you yeah. make cho you make chocolate yeah. out of this? Yeah, I've got some. Have you done? Have you processed we, any of these we, before? We're working on it right now. Oh. I got the. I had a real good one that fully developed over here. So anyway, you saw the the big 
cacao. And that's a huge. That, those are huge over there. How many of these seeds are normally in one of the, in one of the big uh, cacao fruits that are up there? That's what I don't know. You don't know that? But like, there's like, a bunch of may, it. Maybe like that amount. More than that. More, more than that. Okay. Yeah, so we got an we idea. Yeah, it's like a whole, okay. like a bunch inside yeah. when you open it. And they they are in this kind of a whitish, uh, sweet stuff. Uh, inside the big fruit, yeah. inside the fruit inside. And they, they, I opened one and I, I wasn't <laughs> supposed to eat it. She gave me that. It's not poisonous, and is it? No. 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 Well, you're still here. Yeah. yeah. It's really sweet. It's real sweet. Yeah. You have to suck the uh, like the skin of the seeds. Oh, okay. Oh, but so, so it's good. You can. You can. Yes, you can do that. You can. Okay. Then after that, you can wash it, and then you have to put under the sun to dry it out. Then after that, you now can. Are these, are these dried? Is it already no, dried? No, because it's not yet. It's not yet. Not yet. Mm -hmm. And okay, then but after you that, that, the next step, step with this would be to dry out underneath the sun. Mm -hmm. Next, okay, okay. Uh, yes. And then what do you do? Then after that, you have to cook it. Roast it. Like roast it. Roast it. it. Roast it. Mm -hmm. um, and okay. after that, you can remove the skin. Oh, okay. You, after you roasted the, it. So the cocoa yes. is inside, inside the center of that. Uh -huh. ah, okay. So how much cocoa do you normally get from one? One. Just a little. You have to have a lot of them to make, to melt and to make like a, a brick mm. of the cocoa. And you know when you like grind this, it has some oil in it. Oh. oh. Yeah, it produces some oil. Okay. So you really don't need to put anything. Oh, okay. When you grind it or make it like a chocolate. I think you have to, after you uh, roast these, then you can grind them in your grinder uh, and then uh, to powder. And then you can add milk and sugar to it to make and make your chocolate. milk chocolate. Milk chocolate. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I hope you do a video on your vlog when you do these. Please yeah. share that when you're doing oh, yeah. the process. That'd yeah. be so cool. Yeah. yeah. Uh oh, somebody got to the cake already. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Lichan? Yeah. yeah, yeah, and uh, Dr. Padaya salad. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
the morning after uh, we couldn't close out the video last night because uh, we were just having too much fun over at uh, Barry's 80th birthday party uh, and it was a long drive back uh, through a bunch of the the real mountainous hillside all those curves and everything like that so we wanted to make sure that we got back safe and took our time anyway here it is the morning after it's a beautiful morning here in the Philippines on uh, November 2 which today is All Souls Day uh, I made a mistake in the previous steps up before I think I said 30 and 31 for All Saints and All Souls Day but it's actually November 1 and November 2 so I'm, I'm correcting that so everybody's clear on the holidays that we have over here anyway I would like to thank Barry and Maida for inviting us to their for their wonderful home and for the wonderful celebration of Barry's 80th birthday now I'm asking everybody to do me a favor you know what makes the Philippines so special is the respect for their senior citizens it's incredible the respect that the folks here who've worked all their lives and provided for their families and they, they should get this respect that they the deserve from all of that time and they do that over here in the Philippines and I'm asking our worldwide audience to do me a favor and go over to Barry's channel uh, and and subscribe and give him a thumbs up and his channel is Barry in the PI all in one word Barry in the PI uh, please uh, take just a few seconds out of your life and go ahead and do that because those few seconds will make, mean so very much to someone uh, who uh, is well deserving of uh, such a thanks. Uh, so please do that. Stop by his channel. He's got a fun channel as well. Anyway, that's about it for today. We're going to go ahead and close today's episode and get this up and hopefully Barry will take a look at it and enjoy what we put together right here. Well, if you enjoyed today's episode, we certainly did, please give us a thumbs up. Please share and if you have not subscribed, just click on a little My PI Dream Heart in the bottom right side of your screen to be subscribed and if you ring that bell you'll be notified the next time I upload a new video. So until such time right here in the very wonderful and beautiful Philippines, you have a wonderful and beautiful day. today's episode and you would like to see more just like these just click on one of the helpful links over to your right and you might be able to pick up on some good information on DIY projects how to or if you are interested in moving to the Philippines and building you'll find answers there as well